Hello oh guys, it's me, Dem the Retro Gamer. Apologies for the interruptions. I can't really get the cutscene back because I'm lazy and I don't feel like doing this crap again, so you're gonna have to not, uh, not have it, so sorry. Use it wisely! Do not even think about it. My boy Ratchet thinking about hypnotizing Clank, man. It's a bit suspicious, Ratchet. Why you gotta think like that, man? Oh, here we go. Shooting up the place with my beautiful robot. Get away from me. Oh, yeah. Alright, so, uh, this gadget isn't really utilized that much. You only see it maybe three times in the whole game, which, quite frankly, we all know that sucks, you know? When a gadget is underutilized, and a gadget like the freaking a Hackathon 2000, actually, how many hack gadgets have I used in, uh, my whole Ratchet and Clank Let's Plays, like, I did 3,000, I think, maybe. I forgot if there was one in Into the Nexus. I think there was one, but it wasn't annoying, like, at all. The annoying Hackathon 3000, that's what I call it. Yeah, I don't know what Ratchet and Clank's obsession with hacking stuff is, but, you know, maybe it's just me. I, I've never really been much of a fan of that. Stop making that noise. I gotta fix that. There we go, now the sound's gone. Oh, we're back here, guys. Alright, so, now that we have that hypnomatic part, now we can go out over here and hypnotize something and do our thing, right? Alright. Uh, oh yeah, I gotta do this to get to the end. Alright, let's go. Let's go, scrubs. So, you don't really use the, this puzzle that much. I think you only use it one more time after this mission. So, yeah, it is kind of underutilized, but hey, again, what can you do, right? Let me have the dodge you, please. Come on, man. Thank you. Pound your little seizure gasm over here. Get away from me. Yes! Bro, here we go. We just unlocked those platforms. <clears throat> so, probably the planet we will return to the most is probably this one, honestly. Like, out of all the planets, we seem to come here the most. Oh, gosh. You see, uh, you guys are a little bit annoying, so I'm going to murderize you. All right, let's hypnotize this one. I remember there's, like, a little glitch you could do with, like, the bolts and stuff where you can hypnotize him, and it'll, like, keep giving you bolts. I, I wish I could try that now, but I got to get the video done. You know, got to do my thing, right? Oh. Woo hoo hoo. Boy, let's go. MLG no skill, bro. Uh. Oh, hey, there you are. Thank you for being here. All right. Oh, stop, man. Stop. I just want to get to the end. Ah, uh, here we go. Boy, person. Yeah, I already reused that joke. So, you know, it's already depressing when you had to reuse a joke that you already used before. So, yeah. Depression. All right. Well, good thing is it isn't like Ratchet and Clank 1 where, uh, you know, you don't have anything. Like, I remember in the first game, like, the underwater section, and you guys saw it. I don't remember if I did good on it or bad, but that section used to be really difficult when I was a kid, definitely. The, the Blackwater City section. Oh my gosh. I don't think it was that hard now, especially in the new game. The new game, I could beat that quickly. I don't know about the old game yet. I'm pretty sure they're both identical, like the sections, almost. Uh, do I need to hypnotize somebody? No? Okay. Oh, yo, we got our, uh, protopet bros. Alright, let's murder them. We're gonna murder you in cold blood with my bouncer. Yeah. Oh, yeah, alright. Let's go talk to Angela now. Nice digs. Yeah. It's a little remnant from my previous life. You were reincarnated? No, no. My Megacorp days. They've got a very generous bonus package. Uh, right. So now that you've got your ID badge, how do we take out the protopet? Watch this. Ooh, ad. Mommy, where do protopets come from? Why, 
believe they come from Megacorp, dear. That's right, Mrs. Robot. All of the protopets in the galaxy come from right here in our factory. Your little friend is lovingly extracted from the original protopet. Each protopet is given a name and birth certificate that it is unique. Our training system helps mold your pet into a wonderful friend that you'll cherish forever. I know, it's so cherishing, so isn't it? Time your child asks, Mommy, where do protopets come from? You can answer with confidence. They come from Megacorp. Yeah, Megacorp, yeah. That factory is using the original protopet to produce all the others. Exactly. If we can take out the original protopet, that'll shut him down permanently. 20% off a complete service at Groovy Lou. Oops. <laughs> Come on, man, it's a good deal. Don't if lose this it. this will deactivate the door to the protopet duplication area, I'll meet you there. Sure you want to split up? Well, Megacorp's orbital defenses are nasty. With two ships, there's a good chance at least one of us will get through. Good thinking. Yeah, I Just bet it's ours, be obviously. Alright, so let's go to the protopet and finish this. So, uh, yeah. Wasn't that a fun let's play? Well, actually, no, we're not done after we beat the game because, you know, after we beat the game, there is extra stuff we're still doing. So, don't think it's over yet, guys, because we still got, I don't know, a couple of more things to do after this. So, hey, I hate that ramp because, like, when I'm trying to thrust your pack to places, it doesn't work right. Alright, let's go to the Protopet Factory in Needle and end this. Are you guys ready? Are you guys, like, hyped up? You guys pepped up on Pepsi? Coca-Cola, Pepsi, yeah, I'm pepped up. I'm so pepped up, guys. I'm Pepsi'd up. No, I actually don't really drink soda anymore, so, you know, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm a water terrier now, I guess. I don't know. I barely drink soda now. But here we are, guys, and we got the epic music from the multiplayer. Yeah, it's kind of nice being here, you know, I like, I really like this planet's environment. You know, you don't really see it that much in the final level because you're inside the interior for the most part, but you're only here at the beginning, so, you know, hey. But I love the beginning area. It looks so cool, you know. Every final level in Ratchet and Clank has, like, a cool look, you know what I mean? Uh, actually, let's, you gotta get some turret ammo. Come on, guys. Alright, there we go. So, uh, let's hypnotize these dudes and do our thing. Hey, yo, bro, get hypnotized. Get hypnotized on that mathematics, bro. Yeah. Okay. Uh, here we go. Yeah, uh, so it's not over, don't worry guys. Just because this is the final level doesn't mean it's over. It is the over for the campaign, so you won't really see any cutscenes after this, but... For the most part, it's not completely over. We still got a little bit more. And hey, look at this, uh, this ode to Blackwater City. It's totally a reference, guys. No, it's, I, I swear it's not. But it is, I'm not saying it's a reference, alright? So don't freaking braid me, Lombax49, alright, bro? But, it is very eerily similar to, uh, what, what am I trying to think of? Blackwater City, the laser section. And, uh, if you guys think so, too, let me know in the comments section below. That'd be cool to know. Alright, uh, oh crap, kill him, synthenoids! Yeah, bro! Oh gosh, stay away from me. Oh! Oh boy! Oh boy! Keep away! Bad tank! Bad tank! Stay away! Stay away! I don't like your tank kind. That's another bad tank! Please stay away! Oh. Okay. There we go! We just increased our nanotech. Isn't that just wonderful? I like commentarying on everything, you know? It's so amazing. Yeah, we are never gonna upgrade this rocket, are we? Okay. It takes a lot to kill these guys, definitely. Uh. What can I use? Oh, yeah, let's use the sniper rifle because that makes sense. Oh, boy, here we go. Uh, alright. We did some damage, but we gotta use the multi star disc. 
to freaking torture them with some toxic sludge. Yeah, bro, take that. Take my toxic sludge. Oh, gosh, stay away from me. Oh, come on, there's another one? There's another tank? Of course there is. Gotta always be another tank here, you know? But we can take it out, guys, because we're the gamer squad, and, you know, we got this, right? If this thing would kill it... Thank you. But see, we came here, like, guns blazing. Isn't that just cool? Alright, you know what? Mega Turk Love. That's always our go-to gun now, guys. Alright. So do we have to kill them all? Like, do we have to constantly shoot them when they keep spawning in? Because I hate that. That's the one thing I do hate about uh, parts of this level, that they sometimes spawn in a lot. But aside from that, it's fun. Will you stop spawning in and die? Jeez! Is Morgan spawning? So... Oh, okay. Okay, thank you. You actually freaking let me come back up here. <sighs> Ugh. My nose. Oh! Alright, uh, let's get out the hypnomatic and hypnotize. This is actually the last time we ever do this. So, that is sad. That is really sad, honestly, guys. And what I like about this section is you have to rely on constantly uh, hypnotizing uh, other things. So, uh, let's go back and hypnotize another robot. There's another one. There we go. Because uh, we're timed. You guys kind of see it, right? If you look up on the top, you can see a timer going down. When that timer goes to zero, or if we get hit too much, uh, this robot will explode. So it doesn't really have a health bar. But when you get hit, the timer does get lower because of that so that really sucks but we got this we got this don't we bro yep see there's the red bun already we are already doing pretty good stop spawning in thank you all right there we go we have done it guys are you guys ready to end this in five four three two one go all right So we are close to the end over here, guys, so we gotta refuel on ammo, and maybe a bunch of bolts will spawn at me in the next part. Yeah, I'm gonna do this to you guys. So there'll probably be two more parts in the campaign, where the first part where we go through here, and then the next part where we fight the final boss. So I will see you guys in the next part. I'm gonna try to get some bolts to get the last few weapons. And uh, that's about it for this part, guys. I'll see y'all in the next part, and I'm out. Peace!